A famous explorer once said that the extraordinary is in what we do, not who we are. I finally set out to make my mark, to find adventure. But instead, adventure found me. moments when life flashes before us we find something something that keeps us going something that pushes us
Sam's pack. Ah! Sam! They must have come this way. Is anyone listening? Please respond. Here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and ancestor of yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously. I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you. Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay. Okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know? How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? It's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamatai... No one believes Yamatai is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamatai. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field without a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. Don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Laura, my little bird. 
I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place has a bad energy. Bad storms, more like. Makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. <laughs> the stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously concerned. Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? something to eat. See if this thing still works. Just remember Roth's training. You can have the best form and technique in the world, but it won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. So hungry. I need to find something to eat.
Right, back to camp. All right, Lars. Right. You won't always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. If you can learn to read the land and the stars, you'll always be able to find your way home. Conrad Roth, captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Roth? Lara? You're alive! Easy, easy. Are you okay? What happened? I remember the beach. And then it went black and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Roth, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay. Music. Hello? Hello? Is someone there? This could be a way through. Damn it. What are these markings? Look for the smoke. We're on our way. Laura, you made it. 
Sam. Um, Thank goodness. Surprise. It's okay. He's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the Sun Queen. Right, Himika. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <sighs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to miss. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds into battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. <sighs> but what happened to you? When I woke up, they were both gone. You gals should make a one and all. We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Raw? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Lara and meet up with Raw. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no, le uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's, it's been a while. It, it's all coming back to me. Get to Raw. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. You're gonna be okay? Yes, I. Oh, we just need to rest for a few minutes. You sit, uh, you sit here. I'll, uh, <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay.
Warn me about the wolves, Doctor. There's got to be a way to raise it up higher. One more should do it.
did it. These are fascinating. I've seen these before. Oh? They must be ritualistic. This female image is particularly interesting. Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. <laughs> Remarkable. Yes, well, let's hope we don't become murderers, too. See if you can work the other one. Handle's missing. Together. Oh, shit. It won't take the force. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Incredible. Let's see if I can fix this up. Lara Croft, an archaeologist from the Endurance, shipwrecked on an island. Another shrine. Who are they worshipping?
All right, Laura. Shall we give it a go, then? Let's do this, Doctor. Whenever you're ready. Sound, Dr. Whitman. Well, there's no doubt. Himiko had power. Some say shamanistic, elemental. A woman wields that much power, and sooner or later it gets called witchcraft. We shouldn't discount anything, even what may seem to us irrational. We still have much to learn about the world. You sound like my father. It could be one hell of a story, Laura. Not if we don't live to tell it. Incredible. Oh, it is Himiko. But look, the bowl, the candles. Why is she still being worshipped? This island, it must have once been part of Yamatai. You were right, Laura. <gasps> the Lost Kingdom. It's like finding Atlantis. But this is real, Dr. Whitman. We're not standing on a myth. No, <laughs> we're standing on a gold mine. Come, quickly. Your friends are hurt. Yes, probably by them. Get back. They can't be trusted. <laughs> You still have a gun. I don't want any trouble. No. We'll come. No. But I insist that afterwards you take us to whoever's in charge. What are you doing? Be quiet. No. I'm handling this. No. 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 Please. Get off. Just, just go along with them, Laura. Do it. Do whatever they say. Дай меня пистолет. Иди. Пошла. Who are you people? What do you want Laura! If they give you any trouble, kill them! Don't hurt them, please! Silent girl. Ответ. Хорошенькая, да? Напоминаешь мою сестру. Run them up! Don't you fucking move! Kill them all! Hey, bring up the prisoner! Yeah, I'm on it! Yes, I need to study you so much more. Run from me! No one escapes. Out! Villager! Not trust my evil Remia! I always Она тоже была порадочной с тех пор.
Tanker? Nah, looks like some kind of research ship. Should be some good stuff then. We'll find out soon. We got a crew towing it in now. They're like killing people. What? Who? Men. I don't know why. I had to kill some of them. I had no choice. That can't have been easy. It's scary just how easy it was. You've got to warn the others, Roth. Don't worry about them right now. You just do whatever it takes to get to me, Lana. I'll try.
Just got word from the West Beach. Looks like a smaller group escaped to the lower forest. Maybe we get a hunting party down there. No. Did you hear that? Stay here. I'll check it out.
see you two go. <laughs> Sorry, they did a real number on your leg. Oh, no, it looks worse than it is. <sighs> Have you heard from any of the others? Nothing. Wait, what are you doing? The wolves took my food pack. The transmitter from the light boat's in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. But you need you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. We're also in the pack. Shit. Exactly. Come here. Come on. Oh. Oh no. No 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 no. <gasps> Oh, don't do this to me, you northern bastard. Okay. Okay. Okay.
close. young lady like you learn to do a thing like that? <laughs> Late shift at the Nine Bells. Wolf's got nothing on a broken bottle. Hey, you got it. Nice work. So I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower. That should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction. Send out that SOS. And I'm not climbing anytime soon. Yeah, I was afraid you were going to say that. You can do it, Laura. After all, you're a croft. I don't think I'm that kind of croft. Sure you are. You just don't know it yet. Well, that's how I'm a fast learner then. Just be careful, Laura.
Sacred figures, servants of the Sun Queen. Built in honor of her priestesses. Incredible. Did you 
find Sam? We're still on her trail. I'm going to try and send an SOS from an old radio tower up here. Any tips? Hey, Laura. You're gonna need to find the communications console. It'll look like a bunch of old switchboards. Okay. I'll let you know when I find it. Hey, hey, wake up, wake up! We got an intruder! Oh, come on, grab her! Please! Do? You don't need to do this! I'm telling you, Reyes, it's a mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex. <coughs> uh, this looks like it might be uh, an electrical problem. You think? <coughs> oh, hello. Hey. Is this little fox, oh, huh? Oh, yeah. she's cute, huh? <laughs> hey, cute, it's yeah. Alicia. Alicia. It's my like daughter. That. Oh. 14 years old. And smarter than you'll ever be. She must must get that from her father. Don't give him the attention. And yeah. I'll take a look at this. Probably electrical. From her father. Nice one. So I was on the walk, right? Doing a spot of midnight fishing. Hey, Grim. Time to button down the hatches. I be right with you. So I was on the lock, right? And this thing comes looming at me, looming out of the water it was. So I give her a old Glasgow kiss, you know. <laughs> Get shot of trouble nine times out of ten, that does. Took me a week to sleep that night off, and I've not touched a drop since. See you at dinner, Sam. <laughs> All right. Can we take B-roll, please? Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, and action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. Yeah, you got it. Cut, 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 cut! Cut! Uh, is, is he coming back? Dr. James. <sighs> I'll go get him. Renowned archaeologist. I discovered the world renowned archaeologist, Mr. Dr. I don't James cut Whitman. Of fish. It's just a fish. It's fine. It's just You're a gonna fish. be fine. This damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing culture to the people, Sam, not dinner. Uh, no offense, Jonah. The audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. You know that. So until we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it from the top, okay? We're gonna make you look like Gordon Ramsay in editing. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take four, action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like that. I've studied them so much, I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle... I remember when you found that one of your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old. It was my first find. Yeah. You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm. That's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. 
For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. We're getting closer to the storm. Well, whatever's coming, we'll get through it, eh? <laughs> Okay, Lara. Pull yourself together. They're counting on you.
Thank you. Please. <laughs> Go to hell. Numbers. Some kind of coordinates. Now! Just the one that needs to be a wreck. Damn it. Well, unless you see a radio shack around, you're gonna have to patch it manually through the maintenance panel. Okay, that sounds simple enough. Yeah, well, uh, you're gonna have to find it first. On those old towers, they installed those panels high up. I mean, way high up. Climbing again. Great.
I'm at the panel. Okay. The tower should boost the signal from the transmitter. Okay. All right, find the emergency channel and get a clear signal on your radio before you broadcast the SOS. Hey. We got everything crossed for you down here, LC. Thank you. Mayday! Mayday! This is Lara Croft of the Endurance. We are stranded on an island in the Dragon's Triangle. We need help and medical supplies. Please respond. Come on, come on. Mayday! Mayday! This is Lara Croft of the Endurance. This is aircraft Nautilus 177 Alpha. <sighs> Searching for you since the distress call from your vessel. Almost given up hope. So had we. We've got your approximate position, but we could sure use a visual. <laughs> I'll figure something out. We'll be heading your way soon. Out. <laughs> <laughs> Laura Croft, you are my hero! Woo! <laughs> hey, you know, Reyes actually just cracked a smile. <laughs> right. Need a signal. A fire. Fuel. Flames. I can do that. Find a way to light this fuel.
can't get it out of my head. A storm that came out of nowhere, out of a clear sky, and brought down a plane. It's not rational. You know it's not rational, Lara. There must be some explanation. I, I just don't know what it is yet. Lara, listen. I saw the crash from here, so you must be close to my position. Just get back here safe. All right. <sighs> On my way. you moved. You and me both, girl. One moment they were fine, the next. There was this storm. It came out of nowhere. It's not your fault, Lara. I called them here, Roth. Hey, we'll find another way. Mayday, mayday. Co-pilot, just up a bear. Another pilot. One, seven, seven, eight. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, badly hurt when I landed. I need to aid. Is anyone there? Captain Jessup, do you read? I've deployed a smoke signal. Please respond. <sighs> Damn it, he can't hear me. I have to get to him. No. His signal's just over there. We've got our own people to worry about. We'll need to regroup as soon as they find Sam. I can't just leave him out there alone. I need to get to him. Sometimes you've got to make sacrifices, Lana. You can't save everyone. I know about sacrifices. No. You know about loss. Sacrifice is a choice you make. Loss is a choice made for you. I can't choose to let him die, Roth. 